Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to do a tutorial on how to use the PS4 controller to play PC games. So first of all, go to the website right here. It should be in the description in the video I made. Um, so yeah, once you're there, scroll down, go to download the latest installer right here, click it. It should take you here, you scroll down, go all the way to download 1.5.16 now click that and say file install it pretty much just wait for it to uh, be ready all right set it up I already have it set up so all you have to do is um, do pretty much what I show you right here just go to agree uh, install it it's gonna install other things for you just allow it let it do it um, once it's done it should say DS4 Windows has been successfully installed. Go to finish. Then start it up. And then once it's uh, started up, you can uh, set up the PS4 controller. The settings pretty much. And it's going to show this up. No compatible controllers detected. So what you want to do at this point, you want to get the USB from your PS4 or any uh, USB that fits your PS4 controller plug it into your computer and um, just connect it once you do that this should uh, show up now that uh, let me see there's a couple of profiles you can make pretty much uh, set it up the way you want so let me see this You can use different ones. I have a. Uh, you can choose your other ones right here. Default. It should be uh, default, the one that comes with it. Uh, next, what you want to do is just make a new profile better. Just click New Profile, go to Edit. Uh, if you move your control stick, it should move around. okay right now it's enabled trackpad so what you want to do uh, you can move the pretty much the mouse around with the trackpad the touchpad that's on the PS4 you have to just like move it but not like push the um, touchpad in use your finger on it and uh, yeah so what you want to do is you want to turn that off because it's kind of bad to use and I'll teach you guys how to use the actual controller to move the mouse around uh, okay you wanna go here you wanna go either left stick or right stick depending on which one you wanna use for it to move around I'll use the left stick for now uh, okay just go here I'm gonna make it so that the left stick moves around like if it's the mouse itself go to here go to mouse uh, it should be up, left, right. You have pretty much set it up how it is right here. Up, stick movement. I want it to move up when it's mouse up. So I want it to act like if it's the mouse, pretty much. Mouse movement, stick movement, left, uh, down, mouse right. Okay, that should be good. Now you want to save that. Save it. Now when you move your left stick, it should move around. But the thing is, you see how it's sliding? It's pretty annoying when you're trying to play a game. It's sliding. So what you want to do is go here. Go to Axis Tuning. Axis Tuning? Yeah, Axis Tuning. I think it should be either Curve or Dead Zone. It should be Dead Zone. Go to Save. Once you do that, it shouldn't um, go crazy anymore. But right now, it's not moving. Or actually, let me try this. Try to curve it. Yeah, go to curve. It's not dead zone, it's curve. Because if you go to dead zone, if you try to move it, your stick, it won't move around anywhere. Um, uh, so yeah. Put curve all the way to 100, because if you don't put it at 100, this is what's going to happen. It's going to keep sliding. It's just going to slide across while you're trying to play a game, and it's going to be really annoying. 
so make sure that curve is set to 100 so it stops uh, sliding you see that set it to 100 you should be set up all right that should be good so left stick pretty much uh, it's good to go it doesn't slide it's perfect you could set the sensitivity how fast you want it to move move it to 38 look it's slower you can make it even slower but that's way too low it won't even move anywhere so you want to have a perfect amount set it up to whatever your sensitivity you want uh, so yeah that should be it um, other stuff you can change here like uh, the battery light or other stuff it's all here but that's pretty much the basic stuff if you would like if you want X pretty much to be let me see if you want X to be the left click you go to mouse you click this right here that's pretty much gonna be left click and make sure you save it if you don't save it it's not gonna add those settings you have to click save once you do that okay now that I click uh, I'll click X and it should let me see I'm gonna do this again oh no I put it on square hold up hold up hold up if you mess up you can always click unbound takes it off you can put whatever doesn't really matter go to this one right here this is uh, X so I messed that part up right there go there click this one and that should set up uh, X whenever you click X it acts as the mouse 